respect the fact that you know if she made the first move on you it depends how no comment you know what i'm no, but I'm, I'm saying how. i'm saying if a if if a girl was like it depends followed how. you and then you know maybe messaged, messaged you yeah. that's making a f- Bro, following is already making the yeah. first move yeah what's your take on it, it depends in it for me okay there's a way you can do it where it'd be like it can look like oh boom like she's interested in me rare, rare, rare. it can look normal and there's a way you can do it where it's like how many times have you done this before i, I get what you're saying you're saying obviously how many times because she done this before yeah, or the whatever. way you approach you can yeah. take it in different ways yeah but that's the thing though maybe the, imagine a girl don't want to make the first move because she might thinking oh do you know what i'm trying to say i made the first move on him i tried to talk to him he might look at me different maybe they might not make the first move that way or it's always known it's for the how, guy to make the first move. It's how you do it. I don't feel like making the first move is bad. It's not bad. It's, it's, I don't, it's, the era that we live in, bro, it's not bad. Do you know what I mean? I just think it's how you do it. Mm. I feel like you can do it in a way where it's... You'd be so, gassed, to lie. What do you mean? <laughs> yeah, well, look at what the guy got. That's normal. <laughs> yeah. This is normal. What? You got that on a daily thing. Not on a daily thing. Like, like, it's, it's, not, it's not a shock, you get me? Mm. But it's a thing where it's like... It's how you approach someone. You get me? It's just simple. If it's too aggr- it can be too aggressive where it's like off putting. Mm. You feel me? Mm. No, it makes sense. It makes sense. Yeah. yeah, that makes sense. You'll do the whole approaching thing though on the roads. Does it still happen? Like considering that you can easily do this. Yeah, it happens online. on like nights out. Yeah? It happens on like nights out. Yeah, yeah. On the nights out. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I don't think it happens. Yeah, a lot of regular, regular, yeah. Bro, they like just run it, yeah. Me. Like you walk into work. You go yeah, to Sainsbury's. Stop. Yeah. But only if you have an opportunity. They ain't got no Instagram. What, what about Snapchat? No. Oh, yeah. Let me then. have your number then, at least. In a, yeah, you ain't a social <laughs> girl, man. Let me have the number. Mm. I can't give you If you ain't getting the socials, you definitely ain't getting a number. I don't know. who. <laughs> Alright, take my number here. Like, just, you know, call me, whatever. Mm. You know? <laughs> give me that opportunity. Desperate yeah, moment. Right. You know what you say? Yo, take yeah. my number. But sometimes it happens like that. Mm. You know what I mean? We're in a situation where a woman might, like, when you first approach her, she push you away. Mm. On the second approach, she accepts it. Mm. I've experienced it a couple of times. Yeah, if you yeah. do a couple of times, no, a couple of times. Like, like you know I mean, the first no doesn't mean no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You might get better. Yes, Leah. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Keep knocking. Mm. Yes. Yeah. No, I get that. So, what, where would you put yourself in a situation where, like, imagine, because because there's a lot of them that have been through this, where the girl don't want to give out nothing, mm. but the guy, I want to say, he's aggressive with it. But he's just not taking a no for an answer. Mm. You never Sometimes know. women like that, though. Yeah. Sometimes women like that. Yeah, but there's women that don't like it. Yeah. And let's speak. Up, let's speak for the, the ones that don't like it. Yeah? yeah. And we get to the ones that do like. But for the ones that don't like it, whether it's a boyfriend or they just don't want to chat to you. Yeah. You know what I'm trying to say? That's been kind of like. You know these girls that you know you can tell they're even walking away like to a point where they're almost turning their head, mm. and then you're still trying to talk to her, and she's like. I don't know, but I have to go and then she stops and then you know well, when you get sometimes yeah, I don't argue with you though yeah. sometimes you get me I know them on the sometimes yeah, I don't argue with you get me yeah, depends yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, you, yeah. you might be right but it depends mm. it so if I'm saying no I would say mm. that was, bro if my sister was in them kind of issues and you know what I'm trying to say mm. I'll be like just stay safe women are you listening <laughs> give your number out yeah and give it about a couple of hours until the coast is clear clear and then block the number. Simple. Some guys will call from other phones. It doesn't matter. Keep blocking. Keep blocking it. He's going to get tired. Mm. Trust me on this. But what I'm saying is, don't block the number straight away, but block it after a couple of hours. After you go home. They say. What are you trying to say? <laughs> Man trying to give you the alley use right yeah, now. Yeah, let him marinate. Got the end yeah. of that first. <laughs> <laughs> Because <laughs> imagine, <laughs> imagine like places that you said, where you say, no, I don't want to give it to you. you start getting bold. Or you want to go home with like scratches and and and, and cuts and that? It ain't, oh, worth it. It, it ain't worth it, Ola. It ain't worth it. Just give it out. I would say give the number out. Yeah, because I'm trying to look at it from a different perspective. Mm. Give the number out so that way you stay safe. Don't give your socials, but give your number out and then block it after a couple of hours. Clean. Let him call Smooth. you. You that know, keep sense. blocking it. Yeah, that makes sense, Ola. You know? that's more safer for the girl. That's more safe. Rather than you giving socials and then this guy's got access to you forever now. That's what I'm trying to say. So number one, you're blocked. There ain't nothing you can do. Mm. Cry, complain, smile, fart. Ain't nothing happening. Get off your phone, man. You ain't got no message. The only peak thing is imagine if they bump into each other. Oh, uh, then you're. What do you reckon, though? Get me. It's just 
obviously safety is the most important thing from it. That's if you don't feel safe, I'm saying. I'm not saying do this every time, ladies. Like, I'm saying yeah. if you feel like, yo, you're yeah. in that predicament. Some women like, been hurt. I, I know personally some people have been hurt on when a guy, say, maybe intoxicated and he tries to approach a woman. Hmm. And you get me? Uh, physically, yeah, 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 yeah physically it happens, her, bro. Yeah, and, and from God, you get me. So you get me. So I understand your angle, mm. yeah, and I, I kind of agree. You get me. You have to know what to do in certain situations. Sometimes that's the way to de-escalate it. Mm. And me. the thing is, why do I want to force myself to get to know someone? They're not even interested, bro. That's dead, bro. Like it's like yeah, yo, it don't matter. I get it. Like okay, cool. Like <laughs> you said, but like you it said, it don't like, matter because <laughs> if I'm interested, that's all. Here's the thing, though, and I remember what you said because some of them might give in after, you know, you know, you keep on knocking on the door. Yeah, That's facts. The challenge don't stop. Yeah. So you keep going. Mm. So like you said, some of them might like that. Mm. Person, like I don't know. Some of them they want to see that you're genuinely Consistent interested. Or, that you're genuinely interested. It's gotta, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, sometimes shoot. it's good to, you know what I mean? Let it marinate. Let it marinate because obviously you know we're having a deep convo. So I was trying to analyze where it was heading and that. So I like where it was going. See, when you share information with people, yeah. do you think it's really, really important, like, to share it with the right people, as opposed to just, you know, do you know what I'm trying to say? So I imagine personal. Yeah, bro. Oh, yeah. Imagine like sometimes you share stuff with brothers, mm. and you might fall out, mm. and then, you know, now he knows all your shit. Do you know what I'm trying to say? Yeah. So my question is obviously like. Do you, is it good to be cautious, like, on, on, on what you tell the person? Because every, anyone could be nice, bro. And, you know what I mean? Some yeah, yeah, some yeah. people you think, yo, they might be very close to you. Do you know what I mean? With and the, you're sharing I, certain things. So I, I feel like it depends, you feel me? On So I'm, my approach is a bit different. Me, I own everything, you feel me? I ain't ashamed of my bad, my mm. good, my embarrassing. I own it because that's what makes me me. Mm. So... There's nothing that you can say or put out there mm. that... You don't know about yourself already. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know what I mean? There's nothing you can say. I own everything, bro. You can't tell me nothing that's going to make me feel no type of way. Yeah, yeah. as long as you know it, that's yeah, what you're yeah. trying to say. No, as long as, no it's like if you're, if you're 100% cool with who you are yeah, and you or your life, it don't matter what another person got to say. What right. can they say? You feel me? Mm. What can you say? You don't want to... Unless you make up something, right, and, that's right. the, and that don't still don't fit me because you that doesn't be lied, cause, yeah, because you lied. Yeah, I'm like, what about you? Yeah, I mean, same thing in it, voila. Same thing. I mean, if you, yeah, yeah, I mean, well, I'm green, bro. No, I'll chat to, bro. To, to piggyback off what you said, it's true though. Yeah. Like, I already accept everything about myself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. nothing new. Uh, yeah, I mean, if you, I mean, if you want to say I got a big forehead, yeah, I agree. Facts. What, what, what <laughs> we gonna do about it? Cause it's not going nowhere, voila. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean, yeah. but if you say, ah, oh, I'm delay, I do this and that, and I don't do it, I'm like, okay, then you made it up, okay, then you're the loser. Mm-hmm. I mean, but yeah, now nah, sharing, anyway, sharing personal information, nah, but you shouldn't share personal information. But then at the same time, you need you to, need to let certain things out yeah, for your own health. Yeah, because you can't keep all these thoughts to your head. What you're gonna go crazy, my guy? Yeah, right, you right, feel right. me? So sometimes if start it start tweaking, it, yeah, you might tell one person or two, but like it should be a thing where you, there's too many people now that know, like five, six, exactly, you get it. Mm-hmm. Then you know what I mean. It'll just be shared like I. You shouldn't share WhatsApp. anything that you're not comfortable with people yeah. knowing. Do you feel me? Certain mm. things you can keep. You have to keep to yourself. Just yeah. facts. Mm. And then there's a lot of things that you have to share. I share a lot of things with camera man mm. because man, it's healthy for me. You know what I mean? Let out, let out, let out, let out, let out. Yeah, and then he gives me feedback, and I let out. Yeah, you're, 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 you're sharing person. it with the right person. With the right person. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? So. Uh, Hopefully everyone has the right person. Yeah, big up the Mali. Yeah. Um, Can we talk about how we how how it's cool to be Somali now? How everyone just wants to jump on a bandwagon? Because yeah, me, I like it. No, that's how it's supposed to be. That's how, how like it's supposed it. to be. Because yeah. because back in the day it wasn't cool to be Somali. Am I lying? Yeah. When it wasn't. Nah, I was still, it, it wasn't. It's when you're the new guy on the block. Yeah, you know yeah, what it is. After you get me, you have to earn your stripes, and when you, you earn your stripes, mm. everyone's behind you. Yeah, but now you know what it is. Now everyone wants to get on that. Uh, now everyone now you see these rappers using a lot of you know Somali words in their bars. Facts, yeah, 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 big up young yeah, ads and that, yeah, a lot yeah. of them, yeah, yeah. Oh, but um, you know what it is, though, yeah, uh, and and like they like to eat what we eat, yeah, yeah because yeah, that's yeah. their friends, yeah, like, your thing, friends. But I feel around. like I feel like now we got more people dominating in in different fields, different careers, mm. yeah. So I feel like people are more of acceptance of us now, they want to push us forward, yeah. but when we didn't have that popularity, 
We didn't have that support. No, but yeah, but I, I feel like every so culture... So you have that. to start somewhere, bro. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The, fact that, sure. the, yeah, the yeah. fact that we are coming together, yeah. you know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. Pushing each other, bro, is a, it's a good thing, though. Yeah, so, you know what I'm trying to say? The fact that, you know, all right, cool. These rappers using Somali words or even eating Somali food, they're around a lot of Mali yeah, brothers. Bass. Then, it's yeah, cool to be around Somali bass. people. They, they know because they're cool. around Malis like that. Yeah. Do you know what I'm trying to say? It's cool. But my thing is, we've always been like this. We've always been great. We've always been funny. Now they accept it. But now they accept it. Like none of us really put some respect on our name. You yeah? there was a quote that people uh, start posting you when it's popular to post. Yeah, you. yeah. That was, and but it's that's, real. That's just that's, 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 that's yeah. a human. Yeah, it's nah. real. That's human. Also, probably was cool, bro. Because I, I, I know people that support other people that they don't even know. Yeah, that's human and nature. And then people don't even know them. We're talking yeah. about the blue ticks. Yeah. We're talking about blue tick artists or blue tick YouTubers, whatever. Yeah, that's just nature, though. Nature. That's, uh, yeah, that's no, human. From the moment we we, but we we have to like as us Marlies. We have to, you know, the ones that haven't made it yet, yeah. still go yeah. out of the way to say, yeah, oh, no, can you share this for me? Or can you share that? Yeah. Yeah. But these same people are sharing other people's um, music or whatever without them asking. Yeah. So automatically, they get yeah. posted up on there. Do you know what I'm trying yeah. to say? So there's different reasons for that. First, yeah, if something connects with somebody, you will post it. Mm. So, for example, if like certain, like maybe, music or a speech or an interview if it connects with you you might post it that's one reason you post can it, to it. Yeah. you can relate to it mm. but another thing is uh, people follow trend and that's just natural nature mm. it's always been like that mm. human beings have always been like that it's not it's not a negative thing it's just you have to start the ball rolling mm. and when you're on fire you're gonna your fire is gonna be huge mm. that's how that's just how it goes bro listen don't support yeah. me when i get to the top support me when i'm eating noodles side <laughs> you hear me yeah. Oodles so, and noodles. yeah when i hear me Mm. Yeah, I mean, don't, be, don't be support me when I'm on top of the mountain. That's Where was you when the climb was? You know what I mean? Where <laughs> was you when I was tripping and falling? You wasn't with me shooting the gym. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, you wasn't with me when I was getting zero comments. <laughs> now I'm doing 3,000. You want to say, oh, it's cool? Yeah, that's, that's <laughs> no! No, but that's not, it's not It's not even a bad mind thing. It's no, not no. a bad mind thing. It's just nature. It's why why there's certain brands are seen as cool and certain brands ain't seen as cool. Yeah. It's why people listen to certain music is trendy at certain parts. Certain music is not trendy at certain parts. Mm. It's just it's just the wave. Mm. And people follow the wave. It's just natural. Most people are sheep. So that's the music part, yeah. So imagine if we have like, okay, we're talking about like Marley's, us Marley's right now, yeah? yeah. Back in the days, if we got married outside the culture, no matter if it's a sister or a brother, yeah. 15, 20 years ago, people would turn their heads. Yeah. Because fact. it was new. Yeah. You know what I'm trying to say? Would you agree? Yeah. Facts. Facts, facts, facts. She's with a, you know what I'm yeah. trying to say? Actually, or no, he's with a, you know what I mean? But it became so normal now. Yeah. To a point where, okay, as long as the Qafq, they're Muslim, you have whatever. That's how the yeah. logistics is. Which is normal yeah. too. Normal too. Of course, the dinta dulo so is normal. Yeah. Now, would you agree, bro? And you can disagree, yeah. But would you agree if I say, if you're gonna do that, so if you're gonna go outside your culture, because now you're already on minus. What? You're going you outside mean? the culture. What I mean by that was Somali dinta kalena. Why like are you on minus? So Why are you on minus? What I mean by minus is there's already a culture clash there. Do you know what I'm trying to say? There's already a culture clash there. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? So mm. minus, you're already in minus, bro. Mm. No, what do you mean minus? I think okay. you're using the wrong word. Well, no, well, what I mean by that is... <laughs> this guy is not saying, minus. No, no you minus. are. No, but what you mean, like, obviously there's, I like there's this. more... Uh, Pressing I his know. buttons. No, a... no, but do you know what I'm trying to say, though? Mm. Like, no, I think minus is the wrong word, though. But I get what you're saying, though. Okay, cool. Would she be able to understand Mamsie? Unless she, Mamsie don't speak English. Like, if Mamsie don't speak English... And, and the pops don't, then it's not like most Somalis know how to speak Somali properly, anyways. You feel me? I get, bro. That's but fast. I'm talking about parents. <laughs> I'm, saying, I'm talking that's about parents, facts. bro. I'm yeah. talking about parents. No, I'm talking about even, I'm talking about us, Somalis. us people. I get it. I'm saying for that person to even just communicate as simple as, you know, just with the parents. No, they can on a, on a certain I'm level. I'm just saying, you know what yeah. I mean when I say it's minus. You're already, you're already. I want to say it's minus. I think it's different. It's a bit more difficult. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. got different challenges. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so you gotta break. Because when you're in the same culture, like, you have different challenges. Yeah, it's tough. Basically. I get it. Yeah, but I say you break even just by you know, okay, culture. That's a minus. I already said that's number one. Yeah, which I disagree with. You disagree? Yeah, I don't think it's a minus. I think it's a dis. Like I think you're not gonna come into the marriage as easy as it would be if the person was Somali. No, I don't. I, don't, anyways, I disagree with that. Woo! Too, I dis I'm I not trying to go that. too left with it. Let's get into it, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not trying to go too left, but why do you disagree? Why do you feel feel that way? Huh? You, you go first. Why do you feel that way? 
What? That, like you feel like, it, like it's a. It's I a, feel like it's a little it's blockage. A, maybe I'm using the wrong word, but I, yeah. you you get one. Tougher road, to tougher road. No, yeah, it's not going to be a smooth. I, I don't even think it's a tough road. Imagine if the mom just challenges. wants to speak to the uh, the daughter in the law. They still or can. They still can. But yeah, you but, speak on a certain right, level. Do you think our yeah. parents would give a shit if, if they brought someone to <laughs> and we could communicate with them? No, <laughs> communicate. You can communicate. As long as you can say people hello. Are, you yeah, can... People are humans. Yeah, like, yeah, 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 yeah. You can go to China and communicate with people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, but my point was, you can, if you're going to step outside the culture, that's where I was getting at. If you're going to step outside the culture and going to... Like I'm saying... if. If you're gonna go there, then make sure it's worth it. Mm. Yeah, but that's well, what, what I mean by that is already Qafta Somali hamburg goose because before it was normal for us to obviously marry someone from the same country, it makes everything easier. Yeah. Yeah. But now if you're if you're if that's this, if you're gonna step outside the culture, for me anyways, bro, I could be wrong, but put your comments down in below. But I reckon if you're gonna step outside the culture, at least make sure it's worth it. Make sure she ten ten. Make sure the person everything is TT. Mm. And the same with someone that has a child, you know, because a lot of mothers get looked at the ones that, um, you know, the four C's and whatever. Who's got yeah, baby you know, mothers and that? Yeah, in, independent mothers and that. Shout out to all the go, independent mothers. All shout the out to all the independent mothers. mothers. Incredible people, man. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah, 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 they, yeah. they doing that, bro. Yeah. They have it tough. Do you know yeah. what I'm trying they're to say? The they're the strongest people, Allah. Yeah, and bro, <laughs> but if you're gonna go there, what I'm saying is, bro, it's true, bro. No, but it's true though. They are strong, bro. What's funny, bro? The the pops is bro. The no, the why, husband why, is not there. Why you laughing? He's, right? he's just laughing. I'm like, let me chat to you. Yeah. Wait, the fan. pops is not there. <laughs> the pops is not there. Do you get what I'm trying to no, say? No, well, you're just trying to get with some brownie points and that. No, no, but listen, the pops is not there. there. Hey, listen, oh, you have to get that. Listen, crazy, you guys are playing too much. But I'm saying the pops is not even there. Or the husband is whatever. It's life, me. Yeah. So she been doing the. You get me? Yeah. After the divorce, it's normal. The, the, the wife Hold doesn't. that. So, my point yeah, is, listen to what I'm saying. That's life. What do you want to do? Uh, yeah, Undo. Yeah, yeah, There's no redo. That's life. Bro. Single mom with kids. Yeah. She, if you're going to go there, make sure it's worth it. Because there's a lot of moms, single mothers or independent mothers who don't put their standards so low some of them I invite. Well, is that the new one? Harry to the house. Is that a new one? Independent mothers. It's better, bro. <laughs> single mothers, you don't want to use it. You know what I'm trying to say? Independent mothers. Yeah, it's new, bro. <laughs> Bear in mind, bro. I know, I, no filter, bro. You know what I mean? My sister, real G. Yeah. 14 years, she's been looking after a little one. You get yeah. what I'm trying to say? That's why so, I said, that's why I don't want to be a hypocrite. You're laughing. You, yeah, that's why I don't want to be a hypocrite. Oh, I don't want to look at it that points, way. Do you get what I'm trying to say? Because well, I say she's like that. Yeah, she's been looking after what the little Facts. one fourteen years. Mm. Strong woman, Facts. get yeah. me. Mashallah. She went back to school, college, graduated. Mashallah. You know what I'm trying to say. So what I'm saying is, if Add you're gonna to step to that, love you, baby, love you. Mm. And if you're if you're in that position, bro, you gotta make sure it's worth it because Facts. the standards. Facts. A lot of them put the standards low. Every Tom and Dick and Harry come into the yard when you have kids there. Mm. Don't like you gotta be very very serious who you're gonna introduce. Like bring your kids around. You know what I'm trying to say? Whether they're sleeping or not, it don't matter. Niggas are close enough to your kids if he's in the house. So it's got to be worth it if you're going to move there. And I'm saying you're going to want to talk to someone like that. It's got to be worth it. You don't want to just... You know what I'm trying to say, bro? Okay. Can I Ooh. reply now? Now you can go. Damn. I got that off to my chest. <laughs> Leave from that. Listen, my thing is you have to make it worth it regardless of their situation. You feel me? You feel me? And I don't see as different culture being minus. I see it as different challenges. You are, you experience different challenges because if you're in the same culture, you still experience challenges. Mm. It's not like that makes it no challenges. It makes it you can have different challenges when you're in the same culture. Mm. You feel me? It could be tribal stuff, or it could be you get me mm. egos or whatever, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Pride, mm, pride. You get me? Mm. But when it comes to in terms of like in the <laughs> Independent mothers, yeah. Go on. <laughs> Go on, get some brand nah, That one, that one, is, that one, that one's different mm. for me personally. I feel like that's different. You know? Sensitive, bro. No, like because now she's that. got a child. Yeah. So that one, one, that one is a minus. That but one she is, has a child. Yeah. Yeah, but I get it. But I'm saying you got to look at it from her perspective. Yeah, she's not going to. She's she not going to let though. everyone come. She's going to be very cautious who who's she going to let yeah, her child. No, but I'm close by, bro. No, but I'm speaking about from like the male's perspective. If you're like a woman with a child and that, like that's that's minus because that it's not a minus, bro. A hundred million. Percent. It's not a minus. Okay, can I I'm gonna bring point? that. Oh, no, I'm okay. gonna stop you there. How? That don't make sense. You no, have to I'm let, gonna let you land. I'm yeah. gonna let you land. 
I so, disagree from the gets, but go on. Yeah, you can. Of course, that's minus. You're raising someone else's ch- child. Go on. That's not, you get me? You get me? You have to, you, you're going to end up with all the responsibility of another person's child that's not your child. Okay. If you and that woman do the breakup, you don't have no say. Right. Because that's not your child. Whereas right. if it was my child and me and uh, the mother of my child break up, I still have a say it's to my child. I still get visits, even if in the worst oh, case of situation. Yeah. In the worst case scenario, you feel me? Mm. That one's different. That one. Okay, I see what you're saying with the the, the if if you end up not being together anymore, mm. then obviously you build a bond with the child, child. Mm. and it's gonna hurt you. Whatever. I get that part, but what I'm saying is, yeah. when you're saying a minus, are you are, were you just talking about that particular part? Yeah, I know. I'm talking about in general. If you're with someone that has children already, like. That's that's minus, bro. Because you have to take the responsibility of that child. Okay, but you get me, and it's but, not my okay, child. But okay, but there's pros and cons. But you've just listed the cons only. No, I'm. I'm, I'm just, I can. Yeah. I can give you the pros right now. No, I understand. His perspective, maybe. I'm mm. just giving my angle. Yeah, you feel yeah, me, my yeah, brother. Yeah. It just. I think. I think that's an L. Mm. In my opinion, Do you mm. feel me. I'm not saying that they shouldn't be with people. No, but, that's your but for me, why yeah. would I like? For me, logically, why would I be with somebody that has another child when I can be with someone that doesn't have another child? Mm. You feel me? I'm gonna boil it down to this year because we're running out of time here. I'm gonna boil it down to this year. Men already said men can't move like a hypocrite. You get me? Mm-hmm. So I don't want no nigger to judge my sister based upon the fact that she has a child. No, but that's, that's but it like, is though, whether but you want it or not. No, but that's a fact. I know, but it's gonna yeah, happen. But that's what I'm saying. Yeah, so that's not. not the right guy for her. Is she, no. My sister too strong in the sense of okay, she will know. No, but okay, every yeah, guy will think about it. My son's name even yeah, comes into some play. Will hold it, though. That's huh? it. No, some, you can hold it, but some, you'll some think about hold it. it. Some will hold it. Some will, as you said, some will feel that way, and some uh, some will do what they have to do. Period. Yeah. Like, no, and I respect that. Yeah. But I'm saying some don't give a, some don't care as long as I they think, have the person. I think you would have looked at it different if you were in my shoes and you've seen what I've seen. Because no, but do you know yeah, what I'm trying to say? Because you know your angle, is, yeah. Because you, know, you experience it at, at close to home. But I'm I'm speaking as a man from my perspective. If I was in the dating scene, if I wouldn't do it, mm. it don't make sense to me. Yeah, but if you had the option, of course you wouldn't. Yeah, but yeah, yeah, Abdullah, yeah, yeah. check this out. Like how we live there and what we've seen. Uh. Obviously, cameraman hasn't seen it like that because yeah. we've been around it, bro. We we've seen we've seen the ups, we've seen the downs, we've seen everything. Yeah, but you know that's, what I'm trying to say, that, but so, that's not my problem. No, I get that. I'm not trying to tell you it's your problem. But what I'm saying is, like you you said yours, we respect yours, and this is how we think about it. We have different opinions there. Yeah. No, but so, I'm saying that, that woman's troubles, yeah, that has a child. That's her situation. That's not me. I never put her in that situation. I get that. You feel me? I get that. So like I I'm not like. I'm not going to be with somebody out of compassion. Like, that's me. No, I'm not saying that, bro. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, we're trying to be on the same page. I don't know what I'm saying. I'm saying if you've just lived it, because you haven't lived it, bro. Yeah. You haven't had a sister where she's been at home for close to 14 to 15 years. Yeah. And you've seen the child grow. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? You haven't got that bond with Walala. Yeah. But we, like, I have, Abdullah has. Yeah. So we're looking at it that way. Like, we're saying, okay, it, you know, it makes, it makes all sense. To a point where, okay, well, well I should weigh in. Yeah. Would I want a guy? I'm just saying, I, I, bro, I just have that move of like, I don't want to be a hypocrite. Mm-hmm. Yeah, cool. I don't want to marry someone that has a child specifically based <laughs> upon that she has a child. Mm-hmm. When I know my sister, you know what I mean, is in that position. That's me disrespecting my sister, bro. Why? It is though, Why? bro. It is. Why though? Because Why I'm, but it is though. Because if I say, if I say to a, a woman, yo, I like everything about you, but the fact that you have a child, we can't be together. Yeah. Yeah. Right, what's wrong with that? So that's brazy. Uh, yeah, bro. How's that brazy? It is. Though, I don't want to take responsibility of a child that's not mine. No, no, but no, no, you no. can't judge I'm her saying, no, based no, I'm, upon that. I'm saying bro. brazy in general. Like in general, I'm saying if if that's what you don't want, that's what you don't want. Mm. There are some guys that don't care. That would that would just that would take on that responsibility because they want the girl. You get it? Yeah. You get it? And so cool. I feel like this cool depends. To you. I just feel like, yo, if the shoe fits you, it fits you kind of thing. That's you what I'm saying. Well, that's fact, yeah. well, that's and that's right. what I'm saying. You know what like, I mean? Because I'm For saying... For me, it just don't make sense. I know. I get you, it. You're on preference. Like, you'd rather have I someone it. that doesn't have a child. Yeah, yeah. I, I think, yeah, that's natural, isn't it? But I get what you're saying. You haven't had someone <laughs> no. close to you, but you haven't had someone close to you where you can look so at So that makes you want somebody that... No, I'm just saying, on top... Speaking from a perspective of... Experience and everything. I'm saying, if you had if you had Walasha living with you, bro, yeah. You know what I'm trying to say? I don't know if you would have looked at it different or not. You could never say, yo, no, I would never no, do that. But that's cool. That's yeah. her thing. Yeah, but, but it's easy I to say that now. 
But you know what I'm trying to say? I'm like, mm -hmm. it's easy to, for you to say that now because you're not in that position. So, what, so that makes different. me want to be with another woman that has a child. No, I'm not saying that's going to make you change your mind, but you're going to look at that scenario different, bro. You might give us some more thought, maybe. More say. thought, bro. Explain to me how would that affect you? What way? Like, Do you know I don't what I mean? Understand. More, I'm saying like, it will give you, it will give you a different scenario when you actually lived with someone who has been independent with the little one. Do you know what I'm trying to say? So you have more I've seen empathy everything. for them. You know, I've seen everything, so it's more close to home. Bro, it boils down to this year, and people, just comment down below. You know what I mean? Everyone's got their own opinions, whether, you know, you're with the cameraman or me, it doesn't matter, but everyone's got their own opinions. But comment down below what you guys think. I think we're both right in our own ways. But, but you get what I'm trying to say? If you've lived close, if you've lived close, yeah. bro, come on, bro. Yeah, nah, well, I get you. What's your favourite chocolate, man? Watch this. I think, I'm thinking. Oh. A, mm, you know, the one with the caramel inside and that. Okay, what's on? I don't even like chocolate, bro. Okay, my one is like Kinder Burnie. Uh, okay, different, right? Yeah. You like yours, I like mine. Yeah. Okay, same shit, different. Yeah, Kinder so, Burnie is still nice, though. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I'm saying, yeah. even with this topic, there, there, there are going to be some guys that are on the side of him. Yeah. There's going to be some guys that side with you. But, bro, Promise is this going to have to continue? Get it. Bro, this is going to have to continue because. Ah, yeah, so some baby yeah. mama's after me. Yo, nah. look after your youth, bro. Leave me alone, bro. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know what I'm trying to say? And you know what it is? Get Another the thing. Keys, you know? Let me, let me, let me yeah, tell you one more thing, yeah. One more thing, yeah. If you get married already, you complete half of the deen, sir. Alhamdulillah. Okay, cool. Alhamdulillah. Yeah. On top of that, do you know the amount of achir that you also get? And I'm not saying that's the reasons why you should do that, <laughs> nah, nah, but I'm nah. saying yeah. that's just the icing on the cake on yeah, top of it everything. Is, it is. The amount of achir that you yeah. get from that. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? So what about if, you're, uh, if a man has kids? and I think that's more calm because then the kids don't live with you. you if me? the man has a kid? Yeah. But a certain, mother, certain mothers or like your wifey or whatever don't want to deal with the baby mother. Yeah, you don't it's have to. Book. You don't have to. But you, it could happen though. You don't have to. Yeah. But guys, we're going to continue this one because obviously we're running out of time. Free the guys. Hey, 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 hey. We're going to be like, who? <laughs> but guys, if you want this episode to continue, link down below. I mean, comment down below yeah. and let me know your thoughts about this episode. We got very, very heated. But yeah, yeah. shout out to the cameraman. Shout out to the independent mothers. And my brother, Abdullah, of course. Shout out to everybody. Shout out to everyone. Love. You already know, Abdullah, it's been a great episode. Everyone comment down below. You hear me? Show love, show support. Do you got to do all that good stuff. Subscribe, notify, goodbye. That's, That's what it is, man. Another day with Unpack. Yeah. Now, Shaggy, and I'm here. Till next time. Come on. Salam alaikum.